I wasn't expecting company, but if you stay out of the shrubs and flower beds, you can stay. Give him a wave, Pops, now that you've invited him in. We're two old guys who enjoy playing sandbox and survival games together. I'm Uncle Craig. Go ahead and sit down. Let's visit for a while. When I went to look at what it would take to upgrade the or add charges to that device the Twi'lek gave me, I noticed something interesting. Uh, oh, and actually get to it by clicking the technological advancement. So here's the mission, technological advancement, and it gives us this list. And I took a look, uh, 34 charges for personal conquest. So just make sure you get your personal conquest done each week and you'll get 34, uh, along with a lot of other stuff. That's a great goal. Right, that's the first thing I do every week is make sure that my, all my characters have achieved their personal conquest. Uh, and then I look down here and uh, 10 charges for master difficulty flashpoints. Well, I have challenges with those. I, I really struggle still with the master level. So I'm just going to skip that. Came down here, war zones and arenas. Okay. A daily area, uh, weekly missions. So th this is the weekly missions here. Here's heroic weekly missions and daily area weekly missions. The heroic missions are pretty easy to pick up. So I thought, well, I'll just pick those up. And it looks like you get 10 charges for every weekly mission, uh, a weekly set of heroic missions you complete. And there's multiple planets. So you could probably get over the 100 charges very quickly. So that's what, that's what I went to do is do that. Not only do you get 10 charges for that, but you get lots of conquest commendations for doing missions. And people who are experienced know that. I just had forgotten it. And then I came here to visit uh, Jenna uh, Therand. And if you look Your here, always good here. Uh, oh, let, let me explain, first of all, uh, why I came to her. Let's put this over here. Uh, again. I immediately started getting drops that were, you know, actually I'm wearing it, I guess. Uh, right here, my gauntlets, Noble Decurion armor. That was a drop. I didn't have to buy it. Uh, you can buy it from, let me move this. Kyla, but instead of buying it from Kyla, I got it as a drop. So I figured since I had it for a drop, let me go over to Jenna and see if she's got the capability of upgrading like. that. And sure enough, she does. And I didn't realize I already had plenty of conquest commendations. You can see from running today so far, I've got almost 100. So it only takes 30 uh, conquest commendations, one noble to carry plumber's gauntlets, which I have, and 21,000 credits, I've got that easily. So I'm going to right click and upgrade that piece of armor. Now, I'm probably going to focus on just this one piece of armor, getting it up as high as I possibly can. Now it's up to 326. Let me get another one and upgrade it to 328. And now you can see I don't have enough conquest commendations. Well, I'm only a couple short. Uh, and it's because it needs 35 now. Um, the higher you go up, the more expensive it is, of course. And I need 35 conquest commendations. I have 32. So I'm going to run some more weekly missions and get that. What am I doing? Well, I'm focusing on intentionally upgrading only one piece of armor. Now, as I do that, it's going to be increasing my Not item again. rating. 274 now. Okay. And it will continue to go up as the armor that I have improves in rating. Okay, uh, it probably isn't going to change my tertiary stats very much. A little bit, not much. 107 accuracy, something I picked up added to that. Uh, Alacrity is about the same. Okay, but it's getting my item rating up. And so when the game decides to drop me gear, it's going to drop it based from what I understand on my item rating and then it will look for the items that I that are the lowest that I have and drop me those items in this case eventually I think it will be my earpiece because I'm not going to I'm going to upgrade everything else except my earpiece but I'm going to do it one uh, piece of armor at a time except for drops if I get drops that are higher level than what I have great but when I come to the upgrade vendor, I'm going to upgrade my already highest level piece of gear and um, and keep going in that fashion. Raising my item rating 
keeping one item very low, hopefully getting higher and higher level drops. As I break those down, uh, deconstruct them, I'm getting lots of components, tech fragments, commendation, uh, commendation sometimes, FP1 stabilizers sometimes. I'm getting those components uh, and currency out and constantly uh, improving my situation. I'm not going to go to this vendor and buy a whole set of gear. I'm just simply going to, in this case, I ended up getting a drop of Noble Decurion, and that's the one I'm going to upgrade and, and work on. So that's where I'm at right now. I'm going to go run some more missions, and uh, we'll be back. Like, subscriber, get off my lawn.